Hello everyone! Today's video is all about Shantikai's Spring 2021 collection. It is their 31st Philanthropy collection. It's all about butterflies with their longtime partners, the Xerxes Society. Let's go ahead and get started. this spring 2021 collection, you have the Shimmering Butterfly Eye Quartet. Packaging, oh my goodness, beautiful. And this collection also includes three lip cheeks. Beautiful pastel packaging, so pretty. With all of Shantikai's collection, there's so much that goes on, you know, from the foundations that they work with, to the artwork, to just the overall process. And that is what really gives you that true beautiful experience when it comes to Shantikai's products. So when it came to this Butterfly Eye Quartet, whenever they include these little booklets, they are always something I look forward to personally. And you should too, because they are Packed with information. These are actual photos taken by professional photographers. Butterflies truly do play a major role in the ecosystem. So it's really nice to support causes like this. If you'd like to pause and read, I love being able to share all of this with you. It really opens you up to a world that you may not even knew existed. And I think it's just absolutely beautiful. Now, as far as color inspiration behind this little quad, it was inspired by an actual butterfly. The wings of an actual butterfly. I mean, I can see it. This quartet of shimmering neutral shades was designed to be the perfect eye palette. On my little note here from Shantikai, it does say that they created this shimmering butterfly quartet to be the ultimate one and done palette. So you know what that means, right? ultimate one and dones. I mean, it is a little quad from Shantikai. And what do I always make sure to do for you guys when it comes to these new eyeshadow palettes? Yes, I am going to eye swatch each shade three different ways, and then we'll create an eye look. And now moving on to the lip cheeks. I love this pastel color story. It's so cute and pretty. Now these lip cheeks are lightweight and moisturizing lipstick lip gloss formula. They're infused with hyaluronic acid for fuller looking lips and a beautiful glossy finish. Aren't these so pretty? Look how, just look at how these shadows catch the light. Truly ethereal. Starting off with a fluffy brush. Whenever you use a fluffy brush, that is going to be your lightest most so a diffused wash of color on the lid. I'm not wearing any primer or anything. We're just doing quick little eye swatches. So that is shade one, rose gold, satin finish, applied with the brush. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my finger. I'm just going to apply it. Now your finger application is always going to be more intensified. And just like that, we have increased the intensity quite a bit. And now for our wet application, which I highly recommend that you take product and apply it to your brush first, and then wet your brush. That's going to eliminate you for creating any form of a hard pan or anything on your actual shadows. Same brush, I just cleaned it off. We're gonna go into shade number two. Shade two is described as a pink, green, gold, dual chrome, high pearl. Now the brush that is less dense and more fluffy is going to give you a very light diffused effect on the eyes, which I think is absolutely beautiful. And it gives you that more wearable option if you're not that day particularly feeling to be wearing a bold green duochrome shifting eyeshadow. This application is definitely giving you that very soft, subdued, 
Beautiful. Beautiful. Okay. Finger application. Oh my goodness. Yes, this is beautiful. I have a good feeling about this one when we wet it. Just by going halfway, you can see how much more intensity you get when it's wet. Beautiful. So now that we have our eye swatches out of the way, I'm going to quickly do a little face makeup application and then we will start our eye look. little bronzer in the crease is just a very light base. I'm gonna go into the taupe shade on a fluffy brush. I'm gonna focus that on the outer portion of the eye. I'm gonna go into the peach shimmer shade and apply that on the lid as a base for a special, special, special shade. And with my fluffy brush, I'm going into the shade number two with the gold, the pink, and the green. Just a little bit on the brush. And I'm going to softly put that on the lid. Just refreshing that taupe shade that we use on the outer eye. And that rose gold shade number one. And going into that taupe shade, I'm going to put that on the lower lash line. And what I love to do is take one of Chantecaille's Luster Glide liners. This one is in the shade Black Forest. It's a very rich, dark green. And so what I like to do is I like to take this and apply it very close to my lash line 
and then I like to take the brush and just smudge it and create a very soft wing. And of course, we are finishing up our look with the Shantikai mascara. Hello. We have not completed the look. We're gonna do our lip swatches, but this is our eye look. I feel very pretty, very soft, very spring. I love that shift on that shadow. It is so stunning. Okay, let's do our lip swatches, shall we? I'm gonna line my lips with tone for this shade. Peach Blossom, which is a warm peach. Kissa, a rich nude. This is a pretty color. Here is our finished look. I went ahead and put back on Clover. Clover for the lipsticks it happens to be my personal favorite color. It goes without saying that these shadows performed and blended and look absolutely beautiful. I tried to use as much as possible on this eye look. So this would be our more bold look. And you can definitely have a lot of fun with one and dons with these shadows. And with the eye swatches, you were able to see that you can definitely keep things soft and toned down and still very beautiful and polished and put together. Now with the lip cheeks, you do get a more sheer first application, but it does build. You also have a lot of hydration from the hyaluronic acid. You have that gloss, that plumped effect. Very, very beautiful. You have that fun little peach. You have this one, Clover, which is my personal favorite. It's a very nice soft pink. And then you have Hyssop, which is a nice, rich, nude color. Absolutely beautiful all across the board. Thank you all so much for letting me share the new Shantikai Spring 2021 collection with you. I'd love to hear your thoughts. Let me know. How are you feeling about this collection? Comment down below. A special thank you to Shantikai for sending over this collection for me to share it with you. Stay beautiful, guys. I will see you very, very soon. Bye.